Don't know why I'm drifting, I'm drifting so Out of my mind Hey guys, this is your reading for August 18th through the September 18th. This is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Let's see what's going on with you guys in the upcoming month. What's going on with Taurus? Ace of Cups. A lot of healing. A lot of self-love. I feel like you're you're trying to... Um, really just get your emotions in check I feel some of you guys have actually met somebody that you are quite fond of here with the Ace of Cups energy Pisces um, Cancer Scorpio energy is here but I feel for the most part this is about uh, self-love here just getting to know yourself and the things that you want and need that you desire here what's crossing Taurus temperance yeah you are at a point where you just want peace um, and for some reason I'm hearing like solitude taking some time away from situations emotional situations that involve other people I feel like there's a need in your mind and your heart to do this in order to to come out on the other side of this a, a different a changed person um i feel like there's definitely somebody that you're thinking about working things out with um somebody that you're attracted to somebody that you have an emotional connection with but right now i feel that you're really just trying to get yourself together you want peace you want harmony here you want balance emotional um, balance in your life currently Sagittarius energy there what is the underlying issue here with Taurus the world you guys have been through a whole lot of shit um, definitely karma is at play here I feel like there's a lot that you guys have learned and um, you're really just not trying to jump the gun not trying to um, just jump into situations blindly you're really at this point trying to figure out the best way for you to have what it is that you want on an emotional level okay is what I'm getting because um, you guys are ready to start over you're ready to start something new and I feel like for a lot of you um, I'm hearing like Aquarius Aries energy somebody with those either you guys have those aspects those signs in your chart or there's there's a strong Aries Aquarius um, energy that I feel like is influencing you guys right now for some reason okay but um, there's somebody I feel like you guys want to start over with you want to you want to do things um, differently with here okay somebody that it ended with let's see in the recent past what's been going on in the recent past Queen of Cups You've kind of learned that, you know, certain situations require certain things, I feel. And you don't just flood somebody with emotions or you don't just give all of yourself in the initial stages of a connection or relationship. Okay. But also you want to give just enough. You don't want to not give, you know, lend your emotions to someone or give your emotions to someone. Um, you don't want to not do that enough. So you want to let people know that you care. And I think that's something that you're kind of like dealing with right now. It's like learning, um, you know, how much to give and, and how much to hold back, I feel. 
with that Queen of Cups energy. Because she has her hand over the cup. So she's just not like, oh my gosh, I love you, I love you, I love you. Uh, what do you want from me? What do you want me to do? I'll do anything. No, that's not this Queen of Cups. I'll show it to you. She's the Queen of Cups that gives you what you give her. Whether male or female. It's just the, the card. So you definitely want to be in this situation where um, you have reciprocation, I feel. <clears throat> What's Taurus's crowning thoughts? Crowning thoughts for Taurus. Seven of Cups. Mm. I do feel like you have options, but you don't really know how to feel about the options that you have on the table. Um, there's something I feel like you really want to do, but you just really kind of confused about that situation. How to handle it. How to approach it. So there's some things that you're really trying to figure out. Um, I feel like you guys are very emotional right now for some reason here. What's coming in for Taurus? Eight of Cups. Hmm. You guys, I feel like there's somebody that you really, really love. And they love you too. But somebody walked away from this situation. Because at some point, whoever it was, whether it's you guys or whether it's the person that you're thinking about, felt like it was emotionally draining, I feel. Or it wasn't, it wasn't what they wanted at that time. But this is somebody coming back. Thinking about the past, trying to figure out whether or not they want to offer their love again, trying to figure out their feelings. So I feel like this is more you guys trying to figure out, you know, what it is that you really want. Did you make a good decision? Somebody's like rethinking a decision that they've made previously here Piscean energy a lot of water up in here somebody's very emotional okay <clears throat> how is Taurus viewing this situation how is Taurus viewing this situation ace of wands there it is wanting to start over feeling very attracted to somebody um this is a gift though. This right here is a gift. This is a gift from God. There is an opportunity here for a brand new start. Because I get that you guys have learned a lot here. You've went through all the houses. You've learned lots of hard lessons. And usually Saturn brings it, it there are hard lessons that Saturn brings, but once you learn those lessons and endure what it is that, that you need to, then there are some, some very good things that usually come out of these karmic lessons. So whatever it is that you've learned, it provides longevity for you. In love, in life. They're hard lessons, but nine times out of ten, you will not repeat the same mistakes again, is a thing about Saturn. So I feel that you guys are wanting a fresh start, and that opportunity is here. You have two aces. There's an opportunity to, to start again as far as this love connection with this person is concerned. I'm feeling very strong Aries for some of you. Again, um, I feel Aquarius, Scorpio, Pisces is here. Could definitely be a Cancer individual as well. Um, but I'm feeling strong Pisces, Scorpio, Aries. Um, I feel Aquarius is here. 
or this person has these aspects um, in their chart somewhere okay what is the influence for Taurus the influence for Taurus four of wands another Aries card right there there's Aries right there um, this relationship for some of you it's a marriage or either you guys lived with this person um, want to live with this person but overall it's just a feeling of wanting to be committed and happy and stable with this person hmm hopes or fears for Taurus page of swords I'm getting that your fear is that this person will not take you seriously this person will not feel like you guys have changed or that um, for some reason I'm getting that this person is very defensive towards you guys and you guys did not get along when you were together so I'm definitely sensing that you know you're kind of leery about even talking to this person maybe you guys haven't spoken in a while here I don't know there's there's something there's some distance I feel between the two of you and I'm feeling like you guys wanting to bridge a gap between you and this individual what is the overall outcome for Taurus what is the overall outcome for Taurus the magician Hmm. I feel that more so than anything you guys are wanting to make this happen you're wanting to figure out exactly what it is that you want um, and I feel like you will do what you feel like is best for you what's necessary for you 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 will do whatever it is that to make you happy just, that's just the bottom line I feel that you guys are actually, you know, you're looking for answers outside of yourself here. The magician is an active energy. So I'm feeling very strongly that um, you will be heard is what I'm hearing. You definitely will be heard. And you will make this person listen. You will make them listen, I feel. Okay. So, Gemini, Scorpio, I feel Aquarius, Aries is very strong. Pisces is here. Um, Cancer may be here. Also, Leo energy. Okay. So, that's what I have for you guys. And I'll be speaking with you soon. Bye now. Uh, I've been blind too long. Now I finally see. The real and fake, who's down for me? Yeah. Yeah. The situation wasting my time. I had enough, I'm tired of the lies. Blah, 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 da, 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 da. What are you saying?